Hello and welcome to my video blog. This week I'd like to share with you guys a little bit about things to think about after you've bought your home to get yourself set up from your utilities and so on. So this is just the things that you're gonna wanna do and have ready so that everything works once you move in. Um, I'm Elle with Santa Fe Properties. I'm sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. So I think many of you already know who I am. But in any event, you know, I'm L, so you've got me. Um, so let me just run down my list that I share with my clients um, when we think about what they need to do. So first of all, PNM, which is the Public Utilities of New Mexico, they need to be sure to transfer over um, any of your gas that you may have if they are your provider. Um, another gas provider, which could be the servicer for your property, is the New Mexico Gas Company. Definitely, um, we can check and see which one is related to your property, but those two, get your gas turned on, get it set up in your account. Um, another thing to make sure you are aligned with is the county, if you're in the county and not the city, but the county of Santa Fe, you wanna make sure that they know um, you are the new owner, so you'll need to send the, some of the documents from title over to them, and they can get everything transferred into your name. Um, if you're not in the county, you'll wanna contact the city of Santa Fe and do the same thing with them. Um, so they'll be sure that both of those will get you set up in terms of water and sewer. So that is what you'll wanna make sure gets transferred. Title will send information to them, but I recommend double checking and making sure you connect personally and you're not left out, you know, in the cold. Um, or in this case, thirsty and without functioning toilets. <laughs> um, another one that I recommend is setting up your, um, your digital, your internet, your cable TV, all those kind of things. So you might wanna reach out to CenturyLink or Comcast. Again, yours, you may have the choice of both in your area. A lot of places in the city do. Sometimes you have a choice of only one, or obviously you can go with alternate providers that are you know, completely outside of you know, the typical fiber or cable networks. Um, but in any event, CenturyLink or Comcast are the two big uh, providers in the area. And finally, definitely go to the post office and get your mail set up. Um, you may have a post office box and you'll have to go down that path or you may have you know, a property box at your location, um, but you'll need to get everything transferred and set up with the, with the mail. The main location for that is uh, 2071 South Pacheco. That is who will set up your account. So anyways, good luck getting everything set up. If you have any questions or you wanna leave any comments, please feel free to leave that below. And um, you can contact me via cell or email. Um, I think you should have all the information and always, you know, my website, lcbold.com.